I'm going to talk about NetGuardians and the cybercrime pandemic, unfortunately, that's prevalent for banks at the moment. Banks in 2020 are having to face the new realities brought on by the COVID pandemic and the move to digitization that we've all seen. But even pre-COVID, analysts like KPMG were reporting a massive increase in the incidence of cybercrime, much of it unfortunately targeting banks. Fraud management systems always used to rely on these rules, such as if a transaction is over $10,000 to a certain country, then flag it as potentially fraudulent. And that worked for a while, and that was okay. But unfortunately, the fraudsters soon got wise to that. And instead of a transaction of $10,000, they'd send a transaction of $9,999 to a different country. So it wouldn't get within that rules. So what would happen? The bank would then implement a different rule for that particular type of fraud. So they're always playing catch up. They're always reactive and not proactive. And what would happen? The customer would lose money. The bank would lose money. The bank would apologize. They'd have to refund the customer. And these never ending rules would grow and grow and grow. You get lots of false positives, lots of customer friction. And that creates a lot of problems with the customer base. Our systems use big data technology to analyze what's going on in the accounts, providing all the relevant information for the fraud departments in an easily understandable manner that's incredibly useful to see exactly what's going on. So we'll see a significant reduction in the fraud impact and the reputational loss that our customers would have had if the fraud had gone through. And we provide real-time analysis of the bank's exposure to fraud. So the bank's senior management can see in real-time snapshot exactly what's going on, what frauds are impacting them in real time. An explainable AI, we provide the algorithms to facilitate prosecutions and investigations. It's no use just having an artificial intelligence black box that sits there and just says, this transaction is potentially fraudulent without having to explain it. We provide that explainability to enable or facilitate prosecutions and investigations.